Given everything happening with AI in the job market, what is the current state of coding interviews? Now, of course, I might be a little bit biased given my association with Algo Expert and the fact that some of my income comes from the coding interview prep space. But I also think that makes me a little bit more informed. So of course, take what I say with a grain of salt, but here's what exactly I'm seeing so far. First of all, I like to think of companies as sort of in two, maybe even three buckets. The first bucket being the big tech bucket, and then the other bucket being the smaller companies. And you could argue they're sort of a medium sized one somewhere in between, but they do oftentimes operate in slightly different ways. With big tech, so these are the FANG companies and the other very, very large tech companies, I haven't seen a whole lot of change at all. You might get something like a behavioral question asking you about AI, but generally speaking, the actual coding interview process is pretty much unchanged at these companies. That said, there is sort of a trend of the questions are getting harder and in times when they're hiring less, the bar is also a little bit higher, but the general process at least has not changed very much. That said, with smaller companies, we are seeing some changes. For one, some of these companies are going away from traditional coding interviews. That's not to say that all of them are going away from them because I don't think this is the case. And if anything, I think the majority of tech companies, at least the ones based in like Silicon Valley, even the smaller ones are still using traditional coding interviews. However, it is becoming a little bit more common to have coding interviews that are more of let me see how you work. And they give you a more realistic problem rather than giving you some data structures and algorithms problem. And possibly the biggest change we're seeing right now is that historically projects have been very important for resumes, especially for newer developers. And this is still true. However, because of AI, the bar for projects is going up a lot because people know that most of the projects we traditionally put on resumes you can now just sort of vibe code out in like an hour. So the bar is much higher for these projects. If you do wanna hear more about my opinions on how to have good projects in this sort of AI age, maybe we'll talk about that in a future video.